So yeah, uh, the weight loss, just a complete surprise. I just wanted to do this update since I've reverted back to low carb eating rather than full on carnivore. And uh, the primary reason for that was because of my lack of teeth. Uh, just gives me a bit more variety. But it seems, it seems I've had a, a bit of a pleasant surprise. No. Since I reverted back to low carb, I've lost about seven to nine pounds in body weight. Now, <coughs> uh, that doesn't make any sense, does it? Uh, I should have actually gained two to four pounds. It's, it's not much carbs at all. It's very, very low carb. It's just that it gives me a bit more variety. So I've got no idea why. Has anybody got any ideas? I don't know. But the reason I'm doing this without my shirt, I just wanted to, to show you the difference because I can certainly see the difference. If you go back to my one year anniversary heart attack video, um, towards the end of that video, I removed my shirt after I've done my exercises. And uh, you can see a definite difference. I think I'd just stopped carnival then, maybe by two or three days, but it weren't many days. Here, now what you see, I've been uh, low carb for about, mm, uh, well, just over two months since that video, or just about two months. Um, and I got these results, and I've got no idea why. Uh, like I say, I'm not, I'm not saying carnivore, one is better than the other. Carnivore is better than low carb, or vice versa. I don't know really, because the carbs I'm taking, as you'll see from my low carb bulk cooking, it's, it's barely nil, no, not nil, it's very, very low carb. It's just that it gives me a bit more variety. I can do that type of bulk cooking and I can do uh, my dear mom's um, Italian meatballs. And so even when I get my teeth in, I'll get, I'm going on my last visit to Budapest in January. And that's when I'll actually get my permanent uh, teeth. Um, so even when I get those, I'm probably still going to stay low carb rather than revert back to carnivore. I, I was never a carbohydrate addict anyway. Um, if I say I'm low carb, I'm low carb. It doesn't, the low carb that I do eat doesn't tempt me into um, eating anything sweet or eating more than I should. It just doesn't do that to me. I, I haven't got those triggers. And so I may just stay low carb because it looks, it looks like I'm having great results with it. So anyway, before I keep waffling on and on, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you tonight's meal uh, on the plate and it's just the best. It's just the best. I promise you, stay with it. And I'm going to add another one that I made a few days ago as well. And that's a, a, quite a bit of a change, but it just shows you uh, that I can now, because I'm low carb, I can have a little bit more variety and which, uh, which makes life a lot easier. So here is tonight's dinner almost done. There's the water and vinegar, a drop of vinegar just coming to the boil for me poached eggs. Here is my um, bulk low carb a portion, a half portion of my bulk low carb meal. Uh, just a couple of videos, if you just have a look back, you'll see me cooking that in bulk. And there, today, I was in the supermarket and I just fancied some burgers. So there they go, they're almost done. I salted them, put a bit of pepper on, and uh, I've just put 
couple of knobs of butter as you can see on top of on, on top of them. So this is going to taste fantastic. Is that how you do your poached eggs? That's how I do mine. So I'll take one so I can isolate it in a part of the pan then I'll crack another one into and so on. Crack another one into the glass and then gently pour it so you can isolate it by itself so they don't all stick together. So there you go, like I said, they're just gently poured in individually and so they're completely separated. They don't all bunch together. Much better like that and you can handle them better and, and remove them easier. And so there we are, all plated up. Look how beautiful that is. Come on, you've got to be joking, man. Look at that. The burgers. This here is my low carb bulk meal, just a half portion of it. I put some uh, of my um, meatball sauce in there as well. It's going to taste fantastic. Look at those perfectly formed poached eggs. Um, very easy to do. And then I just finished it off with some. A sprinkle of uh, Parmigiano Reggiano cheese and this is gonna taste absolutely fantastic so I'm gonna get stuck into that so there we are I added some uh, Reggiano Parmigiano cheese as well just grated a little bit there so there we have it look uh, three poached eggs um, my <clears throat> onion, celery, garlic and my lovely tomato sauce blended up in the Nutribullet nice and smooth for my teeth and my slightly warmed up uh, sardines and crab tinned in water so this is going to be beautiful a change a lovely change uh, for tonight's meal so I'm going to really enjoy that so there's a, a lovely low carb very low carb meal why not try it for yourself so yeah uh, the weight loss just a complete surprise anyway um, I'm going to enjoy my dinner like and subscribe, I'd, I'd appreciate it, and I'll uh, I'll see you next time. Bye.